Hey, it's Nathan Williams with Crazy on Marketing. In this video, I'm gonna show you a little trick to help you with your Google ads and your YouTube ads. Like if they're not running for some reason, then it may be because you're falling into this situation here and this little trick can help you out. So as you see right here, I have an ad group and I'm targeting some people right here and I'm getting an error. It says too small to target for Google properties. And basically my retargeting list is too small. It's less than a thousand people. And as you can see, Google isn't sending any impressions or anything over to this group of people. And that's a shame because I want this group of people to see my ads, right? I would not have targeted these, this group of people if um, I didn't want them to see my ad. So there's a way to work around this. And that's what I'm gonna show you here. So if you're running into this too small audience issue, this will hopefully help you. So I'm gonna come up here to tools and settings and go to audience manager. And I'm gonna click this little plus button here and go to custom combination. And now what I can go ahead and do is I'll look for my two audiences. So I had nine days. So I had website visitors in the last nine days and this is the audience that was too small for Google to run ads to. And then I wanna combine it with my viewed any video in the last nine days audience. And this audience was large enough for Google to run ads to. So by combining these two audiences, audiences together, I should make a big audience, right? And I should be able to now run ads to both people that have visited any page and also people that have viewed any video. So it combines the small audiences to make a big audience and then hopefully you can go ahead and run your ads to it. So let's go ahead and name it real quick. I'm just gonna call it demo combined audience. And you do wanna go ahead and make sure that your option here is any of these audiences. So you want an or statement so that one, and then you can hit done and just double check your options. It should look something like this right here. You can add an additional description if you want to, but again, it's optional. And I'll go ahead and create an audience now. Let me go ahead and change my filter real quick so I can find this new audience that I just set up. And so here's my new combined list right here. And you see it says size zero right now. And that's because Google's going out there to combine the audience. And it's gonna take, it seems to take about 24 hours for it to actually like combine the audiences together. But if you come back in 24 hours from now, hopefully you see, you know, a couple thousand people or whatever audience size you're hoping to see, you see right in here. And it also just these sizes over here too. So once you see that you have your audience you know, that it's combined the audiences, then you can go back to your campaigns and you come back into your audience settings and, you know, click the pencil thing, select an ad group, select the appropriate ad group. And then I'll go ahead and search for my demo audience that I just created. So demo combined audience, and I can go ahead and save it here. And now I'm targeting my demo combined audience as well. Now it says too small to target for Google properties, because again, I haven't waited the 24 hours for the audience to build itself. So you'll get that error unless you wait enough time for the audience to actually become combined. And once you've done this, what I usually do is I go ahead and pause my other audiences that I was targeting. I pause both of them because now they're combined into one and then that way I'm only targeting that one audience and Google's not yelling at me because my audience is too small. So if your ads are not delivering, it could be because your audiences are too small and what you can go ahead and do is combine the audiences together to make a super big audience and then target that super big audience and hopefully Google will be happy and let you run your ads. And that's it for this video. I hope you found it helpful. Have a great Great rest of the day.